super hard at that. And when I come home, my relaxation is creativity and painting. All right, so here we go. I'm gonna take one more look in the camera. All right, cool. So I have my um, canvas is all taped off and I use these um, because the paint is gonna drip down. And don't worry, Santa Cruz, I save that paint that drips down, it hardens, and then I recycle it and I use it to make uh, refrigerator magnets. Everything I have, I recycle and reuse. All right, so here we go. So that is my uh, my wet sand. I'm trying to get this. And I in the uh, stories I put up um, a process video of this. So if you miss this live, you can see it in the stories. I like to, on these beach swipes, I kind of try and get a rocky look, sandy, rocky. Sometimes it looks like you're um, looking down from a cliff. These are pretty. And I have uh, pre-mixed all my paints, as you can see. I'm using um, Amsterdam standard uh, paints and Liquitex basics paints. All right, this is my swipe color. All of these paints have silicone mixed in with them. Okay, so now I'm gonna get my sides covered, tilt it off a little bit. And we're going to swipe onto a paper towel. Like this. I just put it very lightly on there and then drag, drag it down. I always miss some spots. I can go back and re-swipe. All right, and you can see some, these are called cells. They're popping up right now. That's from the silicone. I'm gonna swipe this again. Ah, it's okay. It's all right if it's a little messy. Cause what is the beach? The beach is not perfect, right? The beach is flowing and there's no rules to this. And I think I'll take a, um, a little, uh, these are just little plastic um, file inserts that you can get anywhere, like Office Max. All right. And now I'm gonna create some more cells. with my torch and this is a little creme, creme brulee torch and the heat of it will bring up cells now i have a fire extinguisher i don't ever use this uh, at home without a fire extinguisher handy and i don't hold it too close to the paint um, gotta be safe so that's about as far as i uh, need to get and you can see the cells will start to come up. Pretty cool. Woohoo! Let's see if you can see that in the camera. Yeah, you guys can see that. Okay, cool. All right. So I'm gonna let that kind of sit for a little bit. 
And then I'm gonna work on uh, the beach part of this, the water. I always like to do the lighter color first and do dark, the farther away, the darker the water. That's the rule, there we go. Alrighty, another color here, so pretty. We'll see how this turns out. The beauty about acrylic pouring is that if you don't like it, I can start over, I can tweak it. Um, worst comes to worst, I can scrape it all off and recycle the paint. Get some more uh, blues in there. All right, cool. All right. Now, I'm gonna get some more white on there. This is my swipe color. It makes it look like waves, right? Get another row of waves here, there, and I wanna get my sides. So I tilt a little bit to the side. And then I always uh, kind of touch up the sides. You can finger pop the sides a little bit that misses a spot and I'll touch up the sides later. But you can see how messy this is. <laughs> Get a paper towel. All right. Get our swipe tool. All right, here we go. The big to do, the big swipe. Actually, let me tilt that a little bit. All right. Okay. So we're going to go like this. Just put it really gently in and then let it drop and drag it down. Oh, that's nice. That's turning out really good. Love it. And then let that drop. Alright, woohoo! Starting to get messy. Let me go uh, wipe this uh, on some paper towels up top, but you can see the cells are already starting to pop up. Alright, we'll get our torch and see what you guys are seeing. Are we still on? Hope so. I think so. Alright. Now I don't want to get too close, popping some air bubbles. And now for me, it's about composition and getting it to kind of look as, as natural as possible. It is um, abstract, um, but it, they can look really pretty. And while I'm gonna let this sit for a minute, and I'll show you, I'll show you one that uh, we just did that's completely finished. Let's see if you can see it. This is um, completely done. Oh, hold it like that. Like that. And that's resin. That's hard and dry. That's all nice. But that's what, that's what I'm trying to get this one to look like. And that is going to be cool. All right. So I'm not too thrilled about this section right here, so I think I'm gonna um, swipe it this way. This, um, 
and see if we can make it look a little bit more like, um, instead of this lacing here, a little bit more like uh, waves splashing on the water. And if, you know, if not, uh, it's gonna turn out pretty. It's not gonna be exactly, never is exactly how I, uh, how I envision it, but we'll get a little bit more blue in here too. Cause it's okay to have some of that blue come up in here in the, um, in the rocks, right? Water splashes up on the rocks. All right. All right, let's see uh, what kind of swiping I can, I can get with this. I'm really liking this up here. I think that's really neat. Hoping you all can see that. All right, let's try a swipe. Uh, let's see if we can't get it down. Kind of wave it out. Ooh, that's neat. Oh, I might just leave it like that. All right. Okay. Wow, that's really pretty. Different. All right. So I'll let that sit for a minute. And uh, see if I can answer some questions, figure out how to do this. I'm going to move the camera.